Hi everyone, Scott Davenport here. In this on one short clip, I'm gonna spend just a couple of minutes in develop and effects to enhance a cityscape. I have this shot here, which is nice. The colors are good, it's twilight, but uh, it feels a little dull. I want the buildings to be crisper, there's a little bit of haze in the air, and then we'll add some style too. So in develop, I'm gonna start with tone and color and just hit auto, which is already improving things a whole bunch. I do wanna grab that haze slider and cut down the haze a bit to let those buildings come through the atmosphere just a little bit more. That looks good. Next is a stylistic choice. I like to add a bit of a purplish tint to my cityscapes taken at twilight. So I can do some of that here with the tint slider and I'm really using white balance kind of as a, a creative stylistic choice as opposed to it being pure white. And that looks pretty nice. I like the uh, little extra purple that's given to the skyline. Now let's move on to some additional contrast to make the buildings pop. I'll move over to effects for that and grab dynamic contrast. And that's doing great things for the skyline. I do want to edge it off of the water in the foreground because I don't want the water to become too hard. So I'll grab the masking bug, the choices gradient, and maybe lower the opacity to something like in the 60-ish range drop it onto the scene, and in this case I'll rotate it around so that it's only affecting the lower portion of the photo. As a final touch, this is really icing on the cake. I have this great sailboat here that was parked in the harbor there. I'm gonna to go to the local adjustments, have my masking bug, and sorry, brush, masking brush. And let's go ahead and let's preload the brush here with maybe a little bit of a nudge on the exposure. Turn on my perfect brush. And I'm just going to paint in to these sails. I'm really just doing single clicks here because the perfect brush is taking care of making sure it stays within those triangular sails. And that's just to bring that sailboat out a little bit. So before and after, just so it stands out a little bit more. And maybe we'll finish it off with a vignette, overall settings, and add a vignette, and something nice and subtle. I don't want something to be too heavy here. I'll use the subtle preset and maybe back it off to even just 50%. So there we go, that was before and after. Really quickly, just a handful of things in development effects really bring some life to your cityscape photos.